not many people know that you can actually copy and paste images and photos across various applications on Android. So in today's video, I'll be showing you how this feature works when using the Gboard keyboard application. Now I will say this will work using multiple keyboard apps. You do not have to be using Google's keyboard for this feature to work. It's just one of the many keyboards that have integrated this feature into the app. I'm also seeing other people using the Samsung keyboard and this feature is working the same with it. And I expect the same with other popular keyboards as well, including SwiftKey. I'll just be using the Gboard application in my example today. So if you haven't installed the Gboard application and set it to your de default keyboard yet, then go ahead and do that now. Once you've set the keyboard up, go ahead and visit a website. I'll be using my own website in this example, playstoresales.com, but you can use any other website you would like. So once we have visited a website and we see an image we want to copy, we're just going to long press on that image like normal. And one of the options that's going to appear here is copy image. So now we have copied this image to the clipboard and we need an, to open up another application to paste it. So let's go ahead and close this up and open up Google Keep. Again, you can use any note-taking application or any other app that allows you to paste either text or images. So whenever you go in and open up another application, you can bring up the keyboard and you likely will see a clipboard icon in the top row. If not, you can tap the three dot menu right here or the gear setting icon to customize this top row but we want to tap on the clipboard icon right there and then go ahead and enable the clipboard with that toggle. Now you only need to enable this the first time you test this feature out. For any future attempts, again, you're just going to tap on the clipboard icon and then tap on that image that you copied into the clipboard. And you're going to see that pop up right there in the note application. So we can test that again. We can copy a different image. Go back to the note taking app and paste that image right into the note. So again, different keyboard applications will handle this feature differently. You can see we can still tap on that clipboard and we have access to all of our copied images. But if you wanted, you could even do a long press. So we have copied a new image. We can come here. And if you want, you can do a long press and paste it just like you would paste a normal image. So that is how the copy and paste of images feature works when using the Gboard application. Again, other popular keyboard apps do support this a feature of copying images from one app to another. It works just like text. Just know that you can copy and paste images on Android as well.